Good morning, West Harvester Elementary School champions. This is Mrs. Esposito. That's right, it really is Mrs. Esposito. Boys and girls, whether I'm wearing the mask or whether I'm not, I'm still here. And believe it or not, underneath this mask, I'm always smiling. You see? So boys and girls, I wanted to wear my mask this morning and my gloves to show you that during this time where we have to really exercise a lot of safety and caution, the people that you recognize may wear masks and remember that they're still going to smile underneath that mask. So boys and girls, let's start our day. Today is Monday, May 18th, 2020. Let's start off with the Pledge of Allegiance. Please stand up face the flag, put your right hand over your heart and say the Pledge of Allegiance along with me. I pledge allegiance to the flag of the United States of America and to the Republic for which it stands, one nation under God, indivisible with liberty and justice for all. Thanks everybody. I hope you had a wonderful weekend. The weather was gorgeous, and I do hope that you did get a chance to go outside and do some fun outdoor activities with your family. And I hope that you were safe by wearing your gloves and also wearing your mask when you went outside. And don't forget, boys and girls, it's always a good idea to carry hand sanitizer with you as well. So today we have one birthday. I would like to wish a very special happy birthday to Amare in third grade. Have a very happy birthday. And as you can tell, boys and girls, I'm outside today in my patio and it's such a beautiful day. And right now I am checking in on the mood meter and I feel very much in the green. I'm feeling in the green because I am calm I am enjoying the beautiful sunshine, the beautiful weather, and I'm sitting here and, and I kind of created a little outdoor office for myself today. And I, and I wanted to just change my scenery a little bit because it's been so difficult to be cooped up in the house. And on a beautiful day like today, I decided to move my office and my workspace outside. Where do you check in today? Take a moment to check in with your feelings. So the other day, boys and girls, remember we talked about, we went over the steps of the meta moment, the first two to be exact. We went over the first two steps, which are sense and pause. So when something happens that upsets you, you sense something has changed. Your body could feel different. Your brain can feel differently. You feel all these strange emotions all of a sudden. The best thing to do right after you sense that is to pause. I also like to take a deep breath. The next step in the meta moment that I wanna review with you is to visualize your best self. What does my best self look like right now? What am I? Am I calm? I am, am I helpful? Am I making good choices? Am I understanding? Am I kind? Think about the words that describe your best self and visualize your best self the next time something happens where you sense an unpleasant emotion. Sense, pause, and visualize your best self. Let me review that one more time with you. Sense, pause, and visualize your best self. The final step in the meta moment is to strategize and act. And we'll go over that on Wednesday. So next, my friends, since we're not coming back to our physical school building this year, which makes me sad, um, but we don't have any control over that. And all we can keep saying to ourselves is we're all doing the best that we can. We're doing the best to stay safe and to do our best with our schoolwork and to be happy at home, okay? And just do your best. That's all we can ask you to do and that's all we can ask ourselves to do. So for third graders, I'm talking to you especially today, 
I know that you were looking forward to so many exciting end of year activities that were uh, created especially for you. Please know that we still have those activities that are going to be planned out for you, not in the exact same way, not all together with our friends, but we are going to do something special so that this way you can um, celebrate the fact that you have completed third grade and completed your first fa phase of elementary school. And we are going to do something special, special for you at the end of June or beginning of July. Um, and that really all depends on when the yearbooks come in. And when those yearbooks come in, the PTA, our wonderful PTA, and our staff members are going to give you a really, really nice send off as you go to fourth grade. So this month, I really would like to, um, to highlight third graders. And if there are any third graders that are interested in doing the Pledge of Allegiance or some of our morning announcements, I want you to call me or email me and we can talk or communicate through email and we can talk about how you can do a special part during our morning announcements. Uh, so we wanna highlight the third graders. Third graders, please email me or call me right at this phone number right underneath my video. So boys and girls, we are going to now do our student affirmation. Ready? At West Haverstraw. I am smart, kind, safe, responsible, respectful, and loved. Boys and girls, you might have heard a little chirping in the background as I was recording my morning message. And I wanted to introduce to you Nancy. Nancy is our pet cockatiel. Would you like to say something, Nancy? Now she's camera shy. And boys and girls, I hope you, that you have an excellent Monday.